Good morning, Engineer. Today you're taking the first airport shuttle of the day from Hartford to Windsor Locks Airport. Let's pull out the main line, reverse onto Platform 4 and let the passengers onto the train. Also, press Ctrl D to shut off the safety system due to only working on the New York New Haven route. Right, ATC disabled. Use the map. Where are we exactly? We're here. We're cleared forward, and we're coming back to there. Let's do this thing. How do I change my in-game background? What do you mean the this thing behind me? Um, it it's again. It's the TS Connect that I wrote um, that looks at. Um, what the current loco is that's driving and um, I've then I've got a big table which maps up which locos are which background images um, and it just sort of figures out yeah you've got to pull forward and then go backwards I think yeah, because we were in a siding. Right, change that switch. That puts us in. I do like these coaches. It's nice to see some different coaching stock on the American railroads. Haven piggyback train. What's my FPS? Yeah, under 15 essentially. So it must be barely because it's still looking alright to me. But it's reporting 15, which is the minimum it will report. Outside the cab, like well, like here. This is twenty six, twenty seven. It's fifteen pointing in that direction where all of this stuff is going on. As soon as that lot's out of the way, it jumps up to about thirty. Great, this train will be stopping at every station until we get to the airport. Wilson Station is next. Gonna make a wild assumption it's going forwards. 
appears that was a fair assumption. Uh, White me possibly streaming tomorrow. I want to see how I get on. Two frames per second now. So we're only just on the 15 mark. Hey Ruben, the airport is presumably where Windsor Locks is. There. the three day streams last weekend oh what well, the one else model railway ones yeah yeah they're, they're always good fun see you in a bit Jakey I like this tunnel this is really quite I like the, this tunnel it's it's uh, been modeled quite nicely it's an unusual shape New Haven horseshoe curve pretty much Pendennis Castle that's a, a pretty fair assessment I think and that's a good thing, because we needed another horseshoe style route. Looks like an EMDF-9. It's an FL-9 flames. So it's actually third rail powered as well for, for when it's on third rail in the area of Grand Central Terminal. Two point two miles for the Wilson Station. A couple of uh, S S2s over there. Very nice. There's um You sure there's no F9? I thought there's which, which is the one that comes in the Zephyr pack? Is that an F9 or is it an FP9? That's what I thought. The F South California Zephyr pack has an F9 in it, yeah. That's the Rio Grande one, the F9. Oh, everyone's favourite speed limit is coming up, 79 miles per hour. Stephen Jam, what I would recommend is if you are timing things to make them work in a particular way for particular timings, then make your passenger stops have timings, because that way, as a player, I know if I'm running behind. And then you're more likely to go back, play it to get to the right times, and then see it how it was intended to be seen. Whereas like this, I don't know if I'm running behind.
GE44 over there. I do like the GE44. Optimistic to think I'm running anything but behind. Well, you know what? <laughs> That's why, personally, I mean, my, my preference is time stops on a career scenario. Because at least in a career scenario, if you're hideously late, you still can succeed and get the tick. Um, whereas the uh, on a standard scenario, you just failed. And that absolute failed for being 61 seconds late is something that I just don't enjoy. <laughs> Windsor Station is our next stop. Did I get that link you sent me from Truck Mag? Well, where did you send it to, Hanban Train? Did you send it via Twitch messaging? I'll try and catch up with those tomorrow. The tankers on this route carry tea for me, do they? For me personally, well, that feels entirely appropriate. Run out of tea. That's definitely not appropriate. I could fix that, couldn't I? <laughs> what have we got? One point nine miles for uh, Windsor Station. Steam Master, how hard was it to create highly realistic looking graphics? Not easy, not easy, but a lot of it is down to very, very talented people. That um, you, you get really good artists, they can they just know what it looks like and what it is. When you're working with tools like you get with Unreal, you can um, they've got the tools they need to express what they're trying to correctly. So, it actually, in some respects, it's sort of it's like taking the gloves off. Of they can um, they're finding they've got the tools to do the work they want to do, um, but it, you know, it's hard actually. It, I mean, particularly the root side of things is getting the population right and having to go back out into the real world and and remind yourself what grass looks like. It, it sounds like a really weird thing, but um, yeah, yeah, it's, it's uh, I forgot my 14L. Whoops. Um, yeah, it's 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 as as strange as that but it's um, Unreal provides a really good set of tools but it's it only goes so far so it's then down to the skill of the artist to uh, to sort of add their bit of the magic and that's where it gets interesting Uh, blessed short Aries um, for multiplayer. Uh, all I'll say is, all I can say at the moment is, um, wait. 
the wait for more information. That's better. The bell wasn't running. Hey, Dixon AD. Do I have an Xbox One? Yes, I do. I got the, um, or well, I bought it for my son for uh, <clears throat> for Christmas, but it's sort of like a primarily his, but we all use it. It's the um, Forza limited edition one because he's completely bonkers about Forza. Sorry, Forza. Uh, Hunter, how long were we working on CSX Heavy Hall before it was announced? Uh, about three years. There are thereabouts. Next station will be Hayden. Hayden Station Track 2. Steam Master, can you ask me an ATS question? Of course you can. Like I said to everybody else, anyone can ask me any question, just don't expect me to be able to answer it. <laughs> High ball. And then a glorious seventy nine miles per hour. My Xbox Live now, I think it's Neutronic. That's the name I use for most things. not my signal. Why was that a signal there that's not showing up on the HUD? Very curious. I don't know what's going on there. What's my plan for the released version of TSW? I'm not sure what you mean, Scott. Well, I would have thought a spad, but it wasn't showing up on the HUD, which makes me think it's a rogue signal of some sort. Do I have Call of Duty? No, I don't really play a lot of that sort of game, to be honest. And I don't really play the Xbox that much. It's very rare these days I get to go onto the Xbox. It's usually um, my kids or my wife. Will I ever get a sleeper cab for the a um, uh, my truck? I'd love to get one, but uh, money is the problem for that. That's what I'm working for. I want to get my sleeper cab. See you later, Duffers. There's Hayden Station Track 2. Has anyone here pre-ordered um, Forza Horizon 3 yet? I still need to do that. Just cheat it in. Just cheat it in. I don't play games like that. There's no point playing a game if you're going to use cheats. Oh, I'm definitely pre-ordering it because my sub. I got the ultimate edition of, um, I think, For Forza Horizon 2, and I think I've got the ultimate of um, Forza 6 for him as well. Otherwise, I end up spending loads of money on the cars anyway. <laughs> He 
He's a bit of a car freak, is my lad. No wrong with that, though. turning the bell off. I'm looking for Grand Tour to Grand Tour. Cameron is looking forward to it. I'm not that bothered. Jeremy Clarkson's okay, but only in small doses. Next stop is Windsor Locks. Oh, you wanted to go outside at this station. lights on? I don't know, I've turned them on on the... Oh, okay, they're on. I had the wrong ones on. Windsor Locks, which I think is the end of the journey. No, no, we've got Windsor Locks Airport after that. Down the branch. miles per hour. Steam! No, claggy diesel! Boo, I thought we were going to get some steam. <laughs> See you later, train boy. What's the hardest part about being a dev for TS? Knowing everything that's going on and not being able to share that with everybody. <laughs> Although that can be fun sometimes when you're going to tease people, but not in a nice way. <laughs> Do 
Bless your Aries. Your best bet would be to go and read the um, train-simulator.com news article. If Steve is about or if someone else can post a link to it. Dick's Nelly, am I from London? No, but I did live in London for about 12 years. Originally born in Suffolk. Um, Dad was in the military, so I was kind of a bit of a military brat, so that's why my accent is generally a little bit on the neutral side, but again, living in... Um, growing up in Suffolk, living in London, and now living here, are all taking their toll on my nice neutral accent. Is it me or is all the audio gone? So did I pause the game? No. Hmm. There we go. Bizarre. James, you've let in your farm and lived in Suffolk and live in Suffolk. Nice. Whereabouts in Suffolk are you? I was in um, Stowmarket. Right, we're off down the branch to the airport now. Moggy from South London. Yeah, it says it all really. <laughs> the mix got quiet, has it? Well, nothing's changed. Maybe I've knocked it a couple of times. Try that. Right, 30 limit coming up, down, dropping to 25. You live near Lowestoft Beckles. Oh, okay, yeah, we went to Beckles one year for um, um, the Norfolk Broads. Two years, actually. Really enjoyed that. Not changing anything, structurally. Don't worry. Make it too high, we can still hear you. Uh huh. Off we go. Pulling off to the left now onto the branch line. Road's too small. Yeah, <laughs> I seem to remember that. I mean, we weren't really in Beckles for particularly long. It was a case of drive to Beckles, park the car, get the boat, go. Network South East Snow would be good white meat. We don't see too much one of that. We did one not run, run not too long ago, but it'd be good to get another one in the bag.
16647 on class or class class 47 network southeast set is quite nice. We've done 1591 recently. Course in the 1950 this is this is unlikely to be Gatwick is it <laughs> got tea brewing get tea out of brew and you know the 68 I think 68 is lovely very nice how far not that far actually to get down to the airport from here Why misuse of horn, Jimmy? There was a level, a right grade crossing there, and I have to blow the horn. 14L. If anything, it was because it was a bad 14L. <laughs> but that's really nothing unusual. And the airport is the last stop. There is no more track after the airport. What route? Hmm. What about PDL? TSW simulations. Oh, it's not a crossing. Thank you for the follow. Must have pretty much appreciated. My favourite DLC in train simulator. I don't know. I've got so many that I really enjoy. Do I have Newcastle, Treadenbridge, just trains? No, I don't. No, I haven't, I haven't got much. I haven't got much content that's outside of Dovetail. I bought my son a, a few bits and pieces. He might have that, um, but I don't. When will Cameron take over again? Not sure. Not for a little while, I think.
walk 15 limit coming up just when we thought it was going to get it couldn't get more exciting Leeds via Harrogate, yeah, that would be good. York to Leeds. It's Manchester to Leeds is actually the one that I like the look of. You're driving the route Euston to Birmingham, but at the end of the scenario, your wagons are three miles behind me. It sounds like there was a glitch in the track. Um, and if you, have a, if you have a glitch in the track, you can find that they shake apart and separate. The other part of my microphone arrived today in the post. I'm pointing down there because it's hidden there. You can't see it. Um, so I'm going to try and get the um, unboxing video for all this stuff finished off tomorrow uh, and try and get that uploaded just in case anyone was interested in seeing a bunch of boxes get opened. Moggy's going to make an unboxing video of him and his Yumus. Excellent. Still got one and a half miles to the airport yet. Yeah? Did an unboxing video of a cuckoo clock. Another cuckoo clock stretch out there. <laughs> good cup of tetley. No, it's not a good cup of tetley at all because it's green tea. It's, it's oolong green tea. Good night, Simon. The last 47 scenario I played earlier on was called Under the Storm. That was by uh, Pinchos. Western Lines of Scotland. Very good. Really enjoyed it. 1.3 miles. Oh, the 15 mile per hour joy.
there any scenarios I don't enjoy? Um, there are. I can't think what they are at the moment, but you know, scenarios that don't have any AI in them that you can see, but they're 90 minutes of not stopping and just driving at the speed limit. I don't really enjoy that. I want to feel like I'm driving the train. If I don't feel like I'm driving the train, then I kind of wonder what I'm doing. And my expectations go up the longer the scenario goes up. So if it's night, if it's 20 minutes, my expectations can be met quite easily. If it's 90 minutes, then it's much harder because I kind of want to feel like that 90 minutes has been well spent. You want the cab view again, Carl Spec? There you go. After the storm, no, under the storm, it's called. It's on the western lines of Scotland. You need to get it from workshop. Maximum speed line on the S route is 79 miles an hour on the main line. We're over here on a branch line at the moment, working our way off. This is the main line up here. Um, one branch, then we branched off the branch. And this is our station stop here at Windsor Locks Airport. Is Locks Airport in front of us? Are there any stars I don't enjoy a ruby? Um, essentially, scenarios where I don't feel like I'm driving the train, or if the timetable hasn't been tested to make sure it works. Um, otherwise, it's just. You just can make it if a scenario just sort of says well you failed and you can't beat it then I don't enjoy that. Similarly, if it's ninety minutes of blasting along a main line at full speed with the regulator at maximum and um, doing nothing but that, then that gets a bit tedious as well. Thankfully most scenarios aren't like that. <laughs> Windsor Locks Airport. There it is there. What's the airport? Well it's that strip of road over there. <laughs>
Oh, there's the airport over there, look. Oh, look at that. Let's open the doors while we're waiting. Looks like it's meant to be a DC-3. And a uh, rather oddly placed Cessna 172. Is that a 172 or a 15? That could be one, it's a 15, isn't it? 152. Windsor Locks Propellers. Great, now all the passengers are off. We can get a quick wait until the next plane arrives. Right, there you go. That's the end of that. Uh, apparently sound is just not working at the moment. I don't know where the music's gone. But anyway, that's the end of trains. Uh, coming up next is American Truck Sim, but I'm going to go and have a quick break. Um, I'll be out in a couple of minutes. Uh, thanks for watching, and I do hope you'll carry on and uh, watch some... It's time for the Pink Pig. The Pink Pig in America is returning. I haven't done the... Uh, um, got my um, my Kenworth running for a little while, so it's uh, it's time to get that driving. I'm, I still want to get that sleeper cab, so I want to find out what the budget is for getting the sleeper cab. Um, right, okie doke. Um, I'm going to put the theme tune on now and then put it on a holding page, and then I'll be uh, back a couple of minutes after that. All right, thanks very much for watching, folks. I'll see you shortly. <laughs>